This week, in the first of our MX TV bike reviews for the year, we take a look at a bike that's a favourite of serious off-road riders, the CRF 250X. The CRF 250X combines lightweight, strong, versatile power and confidently responsive handling in one of the finest dirt bikes to be found in the world of off-road riding. For 2010, the 250X has a host of unique new features, including Tag T2 fat bars with Honda branded bar pad, tag grips, front headlight shroud and bark buster handguards. OK, time to hear what Belly and Jamie thought. Today we're testing the CRF 250X. Now it's not stock out of the crate, it's a bike Honda's hooked up for MXTV for 2010, so that's why we've made a few changes to it. I didn't really expect a great deal of change from uh, this year to last year's model of the CRF 250X, um, and I was, I was pretty close to the mark there. There is one thing that's changed, the back guard, it's white, the seat's red, and the other important part about this bike is the speedo's changed as well. Now they did have a problem with the speedos before, or I certainly did, with the water getting into it. So far so good, haven't had one ounce of water and the speedo works fantastic. I really enjoyed the bike's handling. I think the suspension and the brakes are, are really well balanced. It does exactly what you want it to do when you want to do it. I really think it performs the best through the tight stuff. It turns very, very well and the engine on this bike is incredible. It just started up, rev it and it gets you exactly where you want it to. It can over rev and it's still got a lot of tractable power down low. Overall, the CRF 250X is a brilliant bike, can't go wrong. It does exactly what you want it to do, you can really push the limits to it, right through from an intermediate to a beginner, right up to a professional. Well, he's been waiting since last year to get back out there. You know what time it is, it's time to let the pro go! Well, not a bad start to the year as the Fro lays down a 2 minute 12 lap there. Time now to see what he can do in the Fro speed test. Great stuff from the fro there, he had it pinned the whole way for a 10.7. We'll see if he can beat that in the weeks to come. He'll be trying, that's for sure. 